Hello from the Valley of Sports. I'm Lizzie Close, a member of the track and field team, and I'm excited to show you our spring sport venues. Situated on the south end of campus, the Valley of Sports is home to LMU's baseball, softball, indoor tennis, lacrosse, and golf complexes. The Jerry Burnett basketball facility is also in the Valley of Sports, but you'll get a closer look at that facility in another tour. Let's start with the golf complex. This is complete with the golf team rooms, a clubhouse, and a pro shop. The facility's porch opens to a driving range, which is open to the public. The Rail Splitter golf teams can practice on three-hole executive course adjacent to the driving range or visit local golf courses including Woodlake Golf Club in nearby Tazewell, Tennessee. The next stop on our tour is the LMU Indoor Tennis Facility, which serves as a place the tennis teams can practice and compete when inclement weather strikes. The facility, which opened in 2017, is one of the few on-campus indoor tennis facilities in the NCAA Division II and is one of just two in the region. With six courts, a locker room, storage space, and office spaces, the building makes training accessible year-round. With upper-level viewing galleries on each end of the building, which can be used as meeting space, it is truly a multi-purpose facility that is used by LMU, the J. Frank White Academy, and the community. During the prime of the spring competition season, the tennis teams compete and practice at the LMU Tennis Complex, which is located behind the Tex Turner Arena and adjacent to the Charles Poteet Tennis Field, which is named for the former LMU tennis coach and was dedicated in 2011. The facilities include dressing rooms, a player's lounge, and a press area. This facility here is known as the lacrosse complex. It's home to both the women and men's lacrosse team. The recent upgrade to turf has made it one of the most valuable and useful facilities on this campus. The field is also used for soccer and field hockey in the fall. The lacrosse field house includes locker rooms, team meeting rooms, coaches' offices, and an on-site athletic training area. Let's head to a ballpark. Well, actually, a pair of ballparks. Once located in the center of campus, the Dorothy Neely Softball Complex and Lamar Hennon Field were relocated to the Valley of Sports in 2018. They now sit side by side and are surrounded by bleachers. The Dorothy Neely Field played host to the NCAA Southeast Regional Championship game and the Southeast Super Regional during LMU's historic NCAA run in 2019. The facility features large dugouts with changing areas and restrooms for both teams. Bullpens and batting cages are available adjacent to each dugout in foul territory. The field is artificial turf and the venue features seating for 250, both chairback and bleachers, a press box, and a concession stand. Neighboring Lamar Hennon Field also features a turf field, oversized dugouts, a press box, concession stand, and seating for 750. There are on-site locker rooms, shower facilities, and an athletic training space. Plus, a state-of-the-art lighting system for night games. The Rail Splitter track and field teams currently train at various locations on and off campus. At this time, future plans are currently being investigated to potentially create an on-campus facility. Thanks for spending some time with me exploring our spring sport venues. I hope to see you at a competition soon. Go Splitters!